Hey everyone, what's up? Today <clears throat> I want to show my my uh, favorite movies from 1980. I mean the 80s. Now I was actually supposed to do the 70s first, but I saw that I didn't really have much. And I have a lot of favorites from the 70s, so this may be be in two parts, but I'll talk about someone, but not all. The first one I got here is one of my favorite movies of all time, Back to the Future. Now, what this movie is about? We have this guy, Marty McFly. He, um, his friend was this guy, Doc Brown, uh, and he um, he invents a time machine. It's a DeLorean, um, <clears throat> and this car this drives in 180 or something. I remember. And then it can, you know, it um, goes uh, maybe back in time or in the future. So Doc Brown gets shot by terrorists, and Marty McFly he goes in the car, and he um, goes back to 1955. And um, yeah, that that's a huge problem because he have to get back again. But that isn't the only problem because. Um, he meets uh, his mother, and she's probably on the same age as he is, and she <clears throat> she gets in love with him, and um, Marty he has to get his own father to to um, to get in love. Well, he has to get his mother get in love with his father, so it's very difficult, and plus he has to get back to his own. Time Superior, so yeah, it was a very good movie, probably my favorite movie of all time. Next one is a very good movie, I like this. It's Beverly Hills Cop with Eddie Murphy. This movie is very funny, very entertaining. Uh, I saw this on the New Year's Eve, uh, <clears throat> it was on TV. I loved it. I just like had to get it on the DVD. I I thought a sequel was very good. Also, um, actually, a sequel was just as good as the first. The third one was okay. Next one is the Tim Burton's Batman. This movie is very good. Uh, this is the best Batman movie. But uh, when it comes to the Dark Knight. The Dark Knight is the best superhero movie, but this movie doesn't feel like a good superhero movie. If you look, he, you know, Batman isn't like a. It doesn't talk about Batman as a hero and all that. But in Dark Knight, they do that almost the whole movie. You know, so that's why I feel that Dark Knight is more like a superhero movie than this one. But still, this is a very good movie, the best Batman movie you can ever get. So yeah. Next one, this is probably also one of my favorite movies. Um, but you know, it's not the best, but I, I really like this movie. <clears throat> it's Big Trouble in Little China. Now this is probably the, one of my first DVDs I ever got. And probably one of the first moves, uh, movies I ever saw. Well, no, I just, I, I mean live action movies. Yeah, so this is like just a great movie. Uh, next one is my favorite action movie of all time. It's First Blood. Now, what this movie is about? Well, it's we have John Rambo. He get arrested by this uh, by, by his cop, and he get arrested for nothing. And uh, they are very bad to him, they like torture him and a lot of that in jail and they like um they make him they push him over the edge or what the hell they call it and they push him far enough and Rambo go he escapes and goes into the woods and all that. It's just very cool. <coughs> Next one is also in my Top 10 favorite action movies. 
It's Cobra. Very good movie. I highly recommend it. Next one. It's... Yeah, it's also in... I think it was uh, number two. Die Hard. Um, this actually is my favorite action movie. But First Blood has so much suspense that that came in the first place and the second. But still, this is a very good movie. Next one, there's a great science fiction movie. The Terminator, very good movie. I love this very much. Um, yeah. And we got Predator. Yeah, great movie. Um, over the Friday the 13th movies, I picked Friday the 13th Part for the final chapter. This is a very good movie. I think this is the best one. Tom Sweeney returned with special effects. It's just great. And I love the last scene when Tommy Jarvis kills Jason. That's an awesome scene. Um, next one is Evil Dead 2 Dead by Dawn. Uh, this is the best of the Evil Dead trilogy. And yeah, very funny and very cool. Next one is Shout Play. Now, what this movie is about, um, well, we have this uh, this kid. He he has a birthday, and then his mother he buys she buys um, a good guy doll or what it was, and um, what was it Danny or something? Andy, Andy, yeah. He gets his doll, and his doll is possessed by um, this um, this criminal. I don't remember his name, but yeah. But the the doll's name is Chucky, and he he tried to get and his soul, so he so Chucky can be um, human again. Uh, very good suspense. This is my favorite horror movie of all time. The Shining, very good movie. Jack Nicholson, favorite actor. <clears throat> and next one, American Werewolf in London. This is my second favorite werewolf movie. Um, uh, first place, uh, of course, The Wolfman from 1941. Uh, next one, this was on um, a second place in favorite horror movies. John Carpenter's The Thing. Very good movie. It's classic. And the last one, um, the Indian Jones trilogy box set. Um, in and I mean, of course, <coughs> um, Raiders of Lost Ark, Temple of Doom, and The Last Crusade. Uh, there is a fourth movie here, and as the bonus disc. So yeah, thanks for watching, um, rate, comment, and all that, so goodbye.